President Habibi's announcement came after a series of meetings with senior cabinet ministers and military chiefs. A couple of minutes ago, I called the United Nations Secretary General, Mr. Kofi Annan, to inform him about our readiness to accept international peacekeeping forces through the United Nations from friendly nation to restore peace and security in East Timor. East Timorese resistance leaders called on the international community to act immediately. I hope that they don't complicate further with politics and diplomacy, the conflicting interests among each of them, uh, and uh, condemn people to, uh, to death. There has to be deployment now. In Portugal, Nobel Peace Prize winner Bishop Carlos Bello called for peace during a church service. Even before President Habibi announced his decision, East Timor's Roman Catholic bishop was appealing for the victims of violence in his homeland to show forgiveness towards their attackers. But it was an audience in Jakarta that saw the lighter side of Indonesia's military chief, General Buranto, when he showed he still has feelings for East Timor, despite what the outside world thinks. Thank <laughs> you.